Dubai just made an announcement that's sending ripples through the world of luxury living. Brace yourselves, because we're about to delve into something seriously extravagant, and I mean, seriously extravagant. We're talking about the Burj Bingati, a tower so massive, so opulent, it might just redefine the way we look at luxury living. But here's the twist, it's not just another skyscraper. This is the world's first hypertower. Sounds fancy, right? Now, before we dive headfirst into the shimmering world of Burj Bingati, let's meet the masterminds behind this audacious project. On one side, you've got Bingati, a high-end property developer from the UAE, making waves in the world of luxury real estate. But here's where it gets interesting, on the other side, we've got Jacob & Company. Hold on to your wallets, because Jacob & Co isn't known for building properties. They specialize in luxury jewelry, the kind that could buy you a small island or a spaceship to Mars. We're talking about wristwatches that cost more than most people's houses. And we're talking the rich and famous here, Elton John, 50 Cent, Cristiano Ronaldo, they've all got their wrists in on the action. Imagine wearing a wristwatch worth a million bucks. What time is it, you ask? Time to rethink your life choices, my friend. But Jacob & Co doesn't stop at blinged out wristwear. Oh no, they want their luxury to reach new heights, quite literally. Enter the Burj Bingati, where property development and jewelry extravagance collide in a jaw-dropping spectacle. This isn't just any tower, it's a tower that's destined to rewrite the rulebook of luxury living. Picture this, a standard apartment in this grand tower could set you back a cool $2 million. But wait, we're not done. The penthouse apartments, perched at the pinnacle of this skyscraper, well, they'll have you parting with north of 200 million smackers. What do you get for all that cash? Buckle up, because it's not just about the apartments, it's about the entire experience. These lucky residents will have personal guards, luxury chauffeurs, and private chefs at their beck and call. Now, you might be thinking, hey, a luxury apartment is a luxury apartment, right? Wrong. These apartments aren't just designed, they're crafted by Jacob & Co., the same folks who turn wristwatches into works of art. But wait, there's more, the penthouse suites. These gems have names like Billionaire, Astronomia, and Fleur de Jardin. What do they come with? Oh, just private aquariums, an infinity pool, and a personal gym. You know, the essentials. And let's not forget the crowning glory, quite literally. At the top of this titanic tower sits a bejeweled crown. It's a lattice of sparkling gemstones that'll have you wondering if you're in a skyscraper or a treasure chest. But don't be fooled, this isn't just any crown, it's a Jacob & Co creation. Because why have a regular crown when you can have one designed by the folks who make watches for people who buy yachts as impulse purchases? But that's not where the luxury stops. Oh no, Jacob & Co has set its sights on records. They want the Burj Bingati to be the tallest fully residential building in the entire world. Yes, you heard that right. Hold on to your skyscraper hats, because that title currently belongs to Central Park Tower in New York City. It soars nearly 500 meters into the sky, taller than the Empire State Building, and cost over $3 billion to build. Now, remember, the average price of a home in Central Park Tower is $22 million, more than most people's dreams. But wait, there's a penthouse there too, and it hit the market with a $250 million price tag. It's so exclusive, even billionaires are checking their wallets twice. But here's where it gets interesting. Dubai is no stranger to skyscrapers, and it's got a few residential ones of its own. Take Marina 101, for example, a skyscraper that's been in limbo since 2017. The original developer, Sheffield Holdings, ran out of cash because, surprise surprise, they couldn't sell as many apartments as they'd hoped for. Sounds familiar, right? This is a challenge that even Dubai has faced. So, what's the deal with Burj Bingati? Is it a brilliant venture, or is it headed for a Dubai-sized conundrum? Some might say it's a high-stakes game of real estate roulette. But hold on, there's a twist to this tale. What if? And hear me out. What if this entire project is a dazzling stunt? A mind-boggling spectacle to generate the buzz of the century? Or, better yet, maybe Jacob & Co is upping the ante because they love the thrill of a good challenge. After all, the Jacob & Co brand thrives on pushing boundaries. Their motto? Inspired by the impossible. It's what makes their jewelry so coveted. Imagine wearing a necklace that screams, I challenge the laws of physics. The Burj Bingati, my friends, isn't just a tower, it's a marketing marvel. It's daring, audacious, and it's got people talking. It's got the risk-takers at Jacob & Co written all over it. Now, 
Let's delve a bit deeper into the symbolism behind the Burj Bingati because it's not just about bricks and mortar, it's a statement, a symbol of human ambition and the relentless pursuit of the extraordinary. Picture this, if the Burj Bingati comes to life, it will do more than just scrape the heavens, it will etch a new chapter in the annals of architecture. This tower isn't merely a structure, it's a testament to mankind's ability to dream without limits. As you stand in the heart of Dubai and gaze at this architectural marvel, you're not just seeing steel, glass, and concrete. You're witnessing the manifestation of audacious dreams, of an unyielding spirit that says, we can achieve the impossible. Dubai, as a city, has never shied away from the extraordinary. They've transformed barren deserts into lush oases, creating islands in the shape of palm trees. They've built indoor ski slopes in the scorching heat. And now, they aim to redefine luxury living with the Burj Bingati. Throughout history, visionaries have dared to challenge the norms, to question the limits of what's possible. The Burj Bingati stands as a testament to those dreamers, those who look at the sky and imagine a tower that stretches beyond the clouds. But the impact of this tower isn't confined to the confines of Dubai. It's a symbol that radiates globally. It says that humanity's thirst for innovation knows no bounds, that we're willing to reach for the stars, both metaphorically and quite literally. It's a beacon of inspiration for architects, builders, and dreamers worldwide. It challenges them to break free from the ordinary, to aim for new heights, and to create structures that defy expectations. When we look at the Burj Bingati, we don't just see a skyscraper, we see the embodiment of human potential. It's a reminder that we, as a species, are capable of extraordinary feats when we dare to dream big. Furthermore, the Burj Bingati isn't just a towering structure, it's a cultural touchstone. It reflects the values of a society that embraces progress, luxury, and the relentless pursuit of excellence. In a world where luxury is often a measure of success, this tower symbolizes the epitome of opulence. It's a canvas where designers and architects create not just homes but experiences, where residents don't just live but thrive in the lap of extravagance. And let's not forget that sparkling crown atop the Burj Bingati. It's not just an architectural element, it's a symbol of prestige, a shining testament to human craftsmanship, and a nod to the celestial aspirations of humanity. So, as we ponder the fate of the Burj Bingati and whether its luxury apartments will find their rightful owners, remember this, it's not just a building. It's a symbol of what we can achieve when we set our sights on the extraordinary. But the hype doesn't stop there. Oh no. The term hypertower might not mean much, but it's already got the world buzzing. It's marketing genius in action, and it's working. So, what do you think about the Burj Bingati? Is it the epitome of luxury living or a gamble destined to break the bank? Would you part with $2 million to call it home? Maybe you'd prefer a yacht? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Well, there you have it, the Burj Bingati, where luxury and audacity reach for the stars. If you're as fascinated by ambitious construction projects as we are, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And speaking of ambitious projects, you might want to check out our video on the world's most intriguing construction mistakes.